What's up, Safe Moon Army? It's Crypto Ben bringing you the latest news about Safe Moon. We got some updates with the CEO here. Looks like they landed in Gambia. So we're gonna check out those updates. We also have some huge price updates for the coin. But before we begin, guys, thank you so much for subscribing to Crypto Ben the channel. We're so close to 25,000 subscribers. But let's go. Let's reach the gear this month. So. Please don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like this video. It really does help the channel to grow and to continue to go up. So let's all together go up to the moon. So here we are in Coin Market Cap. Let's check out what's been happening to this coin for the last couple of hours, the last couple of days. You can see here the market for this coin right now is 2.16 here million dollars. So 1.5% up. Basically, the full dollar market cap is 3.6 billion dollars, as you can see, and the volume in the last 24 hours is 23 million dollars. So this is awesome to see. So we're kind of going up right now. So if I, I can show you guys in the chart, but we are slowly seeing some increase. But it looks like Bitcoin is also increasing. So that's awesome to see. 1.5, like I said, million watch, which is amazing to see. The start tick out, it just looks beautiful. This looks awesome to see here that we have the Certic Audit. It should mean that there's no rock pull, there's no a problem with the coin here, and that's just amazing. So here the volume, as you can see, Pegex Swap, guys. Pegex Swap is the top one. This is where people most like, likely buy the coin and the coin. So this is pretty interesting. I don't even really know this exchange, but it looks like a lot of people are buying from this exchange here. here. So we're going to see what's going to happen to this coin. But of course, you can buy it on all these exchanges, but do watch out for the tokenomics. Look at this breaking through the top side of the triangle here finally once more so we did have a huge increase here but still a lot of things happening to this coin I have to first go to the one hour chart if it does load here <laughs> for some reason dex.guru is just lagging so much today but there you go so basically we broke to the top side of this my triangle here one more time so what happened here is that we did go down then we slowly got up we did go down again so look at this boom this here is kind of my triangle we did make this triangle and boom breaking to the top side like the i had like two triangles but it looks like we broke through the top side of both of them so hopefully we are going to continue to go up so this here is the triangle just going to show you guys this part here let me just do this so you guys can see a little bit better something like this is the triangle also this here is that exact same triangle so two triangles basically saying that the exact same thing we have to break to the top side of this level i can actually delete this part here so break to the top side should mean we have we're gonna have some increase for this coin and as you can see right now we are having that increase so how much did we increase ever since the dip if you do just look at this one here you can see basically 15 percent we've been going up by 15 percent which is amazing hopefully we will be able if we do continue to go up we will be able to reach all the way to this level at almost yeah nine percent here that's going to be amazing for safe one guys it's going to be amazing for safe one if we could go and increase even more here but we're gonna see because if we do check out bitcoin here this is what happening to bitcoin right now and this is just pretty good this is really good not gonna lie because uh, we are still inside of my giant triangle here for bitcoin and this is a huge huge triangle that has been forming here and we are still continuing to be inside of this triangle this here is that triangle and as you can see oh uh, we did break to the top side here so bitcoin did increase by a lot let me just measure this so from here to here it did increase by 13 percent it's just amazing to see just one day 13 percent for bitcoin but of course you have to do remember that we did go down by a lot here but a lot of people did buy the dip here so hopefully we do continue here to go a little bit more up and we do stabilize i think we're gonna get some stabilization right now for this low because we already pumped two times so we had this pump here stabilization okay three times actually so pump here stabilization pump stabilization pump so pretty much we're gonna see some stabilization probably now and maybe see another pump and then a lot of stabilization we're gonna just need a lot of stabilization you can just see the rsi it's at the limits so Pretty much at the limits of the RSI, we can't go too much more. Like this is, as you can see here, every time we do get rejected the RSI. So what, we, what needs to happen is that we need to stabilize to make the RSI go down a little bit. They get more room to continue to go up. And what's really good to one of our chart here is that we're slowly, as you can see here, we're getting another cross. This is going to be a bullish cross pretty soon if we continue to stabilize and if we continue to go up. That's just amazing news. It's just a really good sign for Bitcoin here, because like I said, if Bitcoin goes up, then SafeMoon is gonna follow. So this is why SafeMoon is going up right now, because Bitcoin did rebound, 
but we still haven't reached that level. So we have to reach the level where we were before and hopefully later on it's going to increase even more. But we're getting to that number. We're getting to that level and we're pretty close here. So 8% left for us to go to. Can we do it? I believe we can. It's, it is going to take some time. But after that, the next level should be right over here. So we're going to need 20% increase if we want to go back to this level. So is it possible? It is. But like I said, Bitcoin has to keep going down. We have to stabilize here. Probably got some new good news about Bitcoin here. And this is why we are going up. And no, I talked about in my latest video about Trump. So because that the value of the coin did go down. But as you can see here, we are rebounding and the value of this coin is going up right now, which is amazing because there's so many different coins are also going up here. That's just so good to see. Finally, we're seeing some market reversal. Hopefully, we do stabilize here and then later on continue to go even more up. If something like this happens, that we we are still good to not enter the crypto winter. Nobody wants to see the crypto winter. I especially don't want to see the crypto winter because the crypto winter would mean that every single coin will go a lot more down. I mean, a lot more down. Like safe and will be reaching all the way probably to this level here. So somewhere around this level. So if that happens, it's going to be mass ridiculous for the coin. And this way we're going to stabilize and slowly, like after that, we're going to go up little by little here. But that's going to take some time. But if we do exit the crypto winter, then we can soon probably stabilize here. Slowly go next. Every single time go more and more. Like level per level. Then skyrocket all the way up. If crypto winter is not a thing. If we somehow not have a crypto winter. But we're going to see. Hopefully this doesn't happen. And hopefully we do continue to go up. But let's continue now. Let's go first to their Twitter. So we have this like a little new post here saying when you understand the value of holding, holding, yeah, basically, Seifun, the rest in, is history. So tokenomics holding is rewarding you. So every time you do hold, the more and more tokens you do get, which is amazing. So that's that's what we have for this post for Seifun on their web, on their like Twitter here, official Twitter. Check mark, boom. But we have 900k followers almost, guys. Almost pretty pretty soon here like pretty soon we're gonna get to that number that's going to be amazing news for this coin so let's continue let's continue so this is what john did say here look at this we have a picture it says we are in the gambia so super excited for the opportunities the gambia can provide and more uh, importantly what we can provide to the gambia so safe one is devolution if you go here to david Look at this. Let's go. Awesome to see one small step for man, a giant leaf for Safe Moon and the Safe Moon family. Let's go. Let's go. Finally, we're seeing that they are going to this place here to the Gambia and doing some really important work there. Really do partnering up with the country. So we're going to see what's going to happen. It's going to be pretty interesting. Hopefully everything will be okay. And in next week's AMA, we're going to see some massive updates about the coin. So hopefully, like I said, everything is going to be okay. And that they are going to finish that things there at least uh, see some potential future for safe from there. But we're going to see. Let's continue. We can talk about the chart. But first, I want to go to the red page and talk about this. It says, new safe from community manager. Hey, I'm Sander. Uh, nice to meet you all. Let me introduce myself. Hi, beloved safe from Redditors. I wanted to introduce myself to all as you are a very important part of our safe from community. My name is Sander. And most people will know me as Warfighter Z and I'm the new safe from community manager. A little bit about myself. I, as I said, my name is Sander. I'm from the Netherlands. So no German, but Doge. Uh, I do play games, so you might see me playing any game sometimes. I came to Safe Home with the intention to make our Safe Home community even better. So this is why I went to listen to you all. I want to listen to you all. Therefore, if something is wrong, message Sar or like myself or another active moderator. All these messages will be read by us. Here is some contact information of how to get in touch with me. So I am active on these platforms for now. So Twitter and Discord. So there you go. Uh, the Discord server, it will also show as Sander. So if you have any more questions or any ideas, suggestions for our community, feel free to DM me or at me on Discord. Hope to speak to you all some more soon. I'd love to get to know your people. Huddle, Sander. There you go. Currently, the safe home page is the only showing pancake swap version 1 liquidity, leading to people spreading FUD that the liquidity pool is being drained. Can this be fixed to reflect the true liquidity? Anyway, welcome aboard. Forward it to the web website developer. Thank you. Yeah, this is really important. I didn't even notice this. Yeah, basically, the website 
if you do go to the uh, safe west so you can see that you can see the stats but the liquidity is showing only the version one but on pancake swap version two we have a lot more liquidity so it should actually uh, show both of those liquidities combined if that's something they can do it's going to be a lot more better there you go so let's continue here we have some more updates so safe moon daily report says here today the entire crypto market took another swing down swing down pulling starship safe moon down with it a new 30d below so while the current trajectory does look dire many had predicted the dip would continue before a push back up over on twitter ceo john uh, CEO Jack and Executive Assistant Carl and Corny confirmed they are en route to the Gambia to further discuss the Operation Phoenix and safe partnership with the country. So furthermore, Safe Moon Blockchain has been trading across Twitter. So there you go. These are all of the analysis here. We have been going down. You can just see in the end we did go down by 10% here, but things are changing. I'm gonna go I'm gonna show you guys how the things are changing. But yeah, for now these analysis were for yesterday. But today things are changing we have some different stats and i'm going to show you that but first let me just find my post here so this is the last ray post i have today it says the lower the price the better off we are 100 million in the volume burns 600 billion safe moon image two only read uh, read when alone okay credit safe moon mark discord so it says here a lower the price the better off we are per unit volume more safe moon reflected Reflected more burn. We all know the price is bound to rise, so let's be happy. We're here where a hundred million in volume burns 600 billion safe moon. At our all time high, 100 million volume only would burn 150 billion. It bridges simplex, USD integrations, card, exchange, wall, NFTs, video games, and so many more features to drive up that volume. We're not talking buying and selling Safeun. Safeun is the fuel for the freedom of the bank. We'll be burning little bits of Safeun costly through transaction fees. 20 billion in daily volume is absolutely possible. So there you go, because 20 million, yeah, 20 million daily, yeah, 20 billion actually daily volume could be possible in the future. And because of this, the burning should be substantially huge. It should be seeing a lot more. That's the thing. It says here, pancake swap generally only accounts for around 25 to 40 percent of the 24 hour, hour trading volume through. So we actually need more than double the volume to burn what we should actually be burning at 200, 100 million. Today, for example, PSC accounts for just 36 percent of the 24 percent volume. We should need 277.77 million in the last 24 hours volume to burn, but we should actually be burning at 100 million 24 hours volume. So take help. So somebody here corrected this person. So we need double that. So that's the problem because uh, the tokenomics guys, the, the tokenomics only work on packing swap and some exchanges, not all exchanges. And that's the biggest problem. So a lot of people do buy from different kind of exchanges. So there you go. This is really 1000 USD per day if you have 1 billion tokens. Well, there you go. Watch his video. Really awesome shit. So he basically explained everything how it does work. So you can check out this video if you do want so. But guys, in the end, like I said, I'm not a financial advisor. If you want to invest into these coins, please do your own research first. Thank you so much for watching this video. If you did enjoy, it means so much to me. If you can like this video, comment down below and subscribe to my channel. Thank you so much for watching and see you guys in the next video.